Hello guys, what's up? It's uh, Nicholas Kolovecki and today I'm just going to run you guys down a uh, haul video that I'm going to do. I caught some styles from Winners today. I found Fabulous for less. Uh, the whole thing all together was 230 and I got quite a lot of shit for that, I, I believe anyway. And it's all quality stuff. It's not like, sure I could go to like some stores and get, you know, maybe a little bit for a little bit less. However... I think that I found the right stuff, good quality, good price, just a great combination of that sort of thing. So um, first, I'm going to start with the most important piece, is a neck pillow that I got because um, on the bus, you get tired because you stay up too late making videos like this. So you like to sleep on the bus, and this basically keeps your neck nice and cozy. So you just go like this. Lay up to the shorty next to you. Just like that, she'll be like, damn, that's a nice neck pillow, boy. And you'll be like, yeah, I know, girl. You want some of this? And basically, definitely going to get laid. So, next item that's... I'm just going to start with like kind of small stuff, working with the big items. All right, so next is the Mr. Sock Socks. They are uh, they have three in a pack. And um, they're basically... They're not the highest quality socks, I can just tell right off the bat, however, they seem to be of a decent caliber, and they just got funky patterns on them, I like them, and that's why I just bought them, I just, and they're a good price too, they're only $6 for three, so I thought that was good. Next, I got some Calvin Klein socks, some white socks, some basic ideas right here, and uh, yeah, so I just really thought that I would. I haven't had white socks in a long time, and I could want some white socks, and a good price for a good quality, they also very thick and $9.99 for four socks like actually really good quality and of a brand name I'm definitely down with that so there are those next I got something not clothing related but computer related actually well it's fair to say the neck pillow is in a fashion statement but then again it is so we got the whoosh green shine and this stuff actually works. I mean, I used it on my laptop, and I put a little bit more than I thought I would on to the screen. However, I did really see results. It's super simple. All you need to do is spray the spray on. All you need to do is spray the spray on. They have two microfiber cloths. You take the cloth. You spray the spray onto the cloth. You wipe your screen. And that, that once you're done finally cleaning your screen, you just use the other cloth to buff it out. Just shine it up, and it just works really well. <sighs> okay, so next item. I think I'll tie, I guess I'll do bottoms. So this is a jogger pant that I got. It's uh, kind of got worn look, kind of a clothy thing. You know, it's got that sort of uh, multi, like kind of speckled gray with the black. And like, I like that sort of white contrast with it. And yeah, so they're just a really cool pant. My opinion, um, I really like them, and that's why I copped them. Um, I already have a pair of joggers that I'm actually wearing right now. But I think that these, even though the colors are sort of similar, they're kind of a different style to an extent. And they'll be a good piece of my wardrobe. Now, next piece we got is a uh, Levi's 511 jean. They're almost not like a jean, because if you actually feel the texture, it's kind of a lot softer than a jean. However, it is still a jean pant. It is um, a slim fit pant, too, so it's kind of the best. You get a skinnier look without absolutely, you know, cutting off circulation. They're actually very comfortable, very elastic -y, which is nice, because sometimes it's hard to uh, wear jeans for a while. Okay, so... Next, we're going to get started on the top, and I got the Slim Fit Comfort Blend Hanging Shirt. I got four of them in a pack for $12, and I think that's a really good bargain, actually. Um, a great shirt, so, like, just obviously a thin shirt. However, it's not a shirt, so that's to be expected. An essential in a wardrobe. Any, everybody needs a white shirt. Hanes It's very good at making undergarments, and, yeah, so I'm really excited for having an essential that I actually haven't had forever basically in my wardrobe since I actually started caring about fashion so now I'm very excited for this
Next, we got another essential. It is the flannel shirt, the classic black and red one. Now, people might not like flannel shirts too much because of the fact they're used so much. A lot of people are unfashionable use them. However, this is kind of the more basic sort of style, the more fashionable one, if you will. The one that more people actually like. Because it's just a plain, simple flannel shirt that has always sort of been around forever. Very lumberjack ass, very Canadian. Um, yeah, and I'll just pair really well with that Hanes shirt and those 5'11 jeans that I got. So I'm excited to wear that, you know, just everywhere, basically. That'll be probably one of my most worn fits. Next, we got a golf sweater from Calvin Klein. Again, another Calvin product. I got three Calvin products today. The next one's to be revealed. It is a gray sweatshirt. Basically, it is, uh, it's very thin, actually, in weight. It's a nice, great color. Just plain, simple, however, well-constructed, good-looking. And it's just kind of, I thought, a good price for what I got, an essential, if you would. And that's why I decided to get the Calvin Klein, just basic, gray sweater there you go now next item we're gonna get is into a navy calvin klein sweater that i also got of a very similar style if you will a little bit less uh the other one was more flowing more draping this one's a little bit more constructed it's more solid it's a thicker sweater it's got these cool black shoulder pads if you would and just a really neat sweater i think i think that uh this will look good in my wardrobe and it will be a good addition to my collection basically. I think I'll be able to wear it often. I think it'll go with a lot and I think it's a good choice. Then um, finally I went to Staples beforehand actually because I'm also tech and I'm fashion. So I got this hard drive because I've been meaning to back up my files for a long time. So I finally got one. Um, I also bought a USB drive to image on and that was kind of a mistake being uh, the fact Turns out that it really isn't the best idea to necessarily image on. That was completely blocked by it. And then I also bought a pair of really cheap JVC gummy headphones. And um, I opened up the package and it cut the wire. So that was no good. 